Welcome to JSA TV and JSA Podcast, the newsroom for telecom and data center professionals. I'm Laura Nolan coming to you from ITW 2021. Joining me today is Fred Rohde, president of DR Fortress. Fred, welcome to JSA TV. Yeah, thanks for having me. Fred, DR Fortress has had an exciting year, 2021 so far. We're going to get to all that in just a moment. But first, if you could tell our viewers who may not be familiar about DR Fortress and your role. Yeah, so I'm the president and co-founder. Uh, we started DR Fortress back in 2006. Uh, it was out of a management buyout. Uh, we used to be Equinix. And so me and my partners, we purchased the facility and then we've been expanding ever since. So we do the same thing. We're a data center as well as uh, the only commercial internet exchange in the state. Wonderful. Well, DR Fortress completed a major expansion this year at your world-class Honolulu Data Center facility. Can you tell us more about that? Yeah, so we're just trying to keep up with demand with our customers. So we expanded, we added about 128 racks. Uh, so we're close to about 600 racks total of our data center. So what sets DR Fortress apart from other data centers in Hawaii? We'd all love to travel and see you, <laughs> PTC, but as you're in Hawaii, what is the differentiator between you and the other data centers or providers in Hawaii? Um, and what advantage do you provide Hawaii customers and industry partners? Well, we're carrier neutral. So we have over a dozen of the international and national carriers and ISPs. Um, and we're also the internet exchange. So this is where the entire hub of the internet for all of Hawaii uh, happens. So we have the content providers and the carriers that actually use us to exchange traffic to keep all the local traffic. And we just launched a new product, our, our Cloud Connect. So out of our relationship with Equinix, we were allowed to connect up to the Equinix Cloud Exchange. So we have a connection from here to LA and also to San Jose on separate undersea cable systems for redundancy, but it allows our customers with one cross connect to connect up to any cloud provider like AWS, Azure, Google, and the like. Um, that is basically giving them an on-ramp onto um, the cloud, because right now they don't actually host in Hawaii. Uh, that's our next step. Great, great. And that's a great advantage for, for businesses looking to extend their reach uh, and, and reach those global content providers um, and really, you know, a leg up for businesses in Hawaii. So that's great news and more to come, it sounds like. Uh, in the meantime, we've got some, some great celebratory news. You've hit a major milestone or you will hit one this year, reaching your 15th anniversary. So congratulations, first of all. Um, and give us an idea of what's coming up next. You mentioned, you know, maybe expanding those connections, but, but what else for DR Fortress? Well, we're actually working on our next expansion. So we just completed this one, but, uh, you know, the sales are, are, are going well. So we're in talks with um, the property manager on getting more adjacent space, um, as well as working with our con contractors on the design. We're also looking for a DR site. So something on Oahu that's uh, somewhere else on the island. And um, we're looking at some potential acquisitions as well. Very exciting, Fred. Well, where can our viewers go to learn more about DR Fortress and, and all the exciting news coming your way? Yeah, you can head to our website, drfortress.com and check us out. Thank you, Fred. Thank you for your time. We appreciate you joining us. Yeah, definitely. Thanks for having me. And thank you viewers for tuning into JSA TV and JSA Podcasts. Happy networking.